welcome guys welcome guys in this video we're talking about zekit right we're talking about what zekit so uh i'll be showing you how to do the video uh uh th this will be the video of uh zekit what testnet right circuit testnet so um before we continue right so circuit is a fully evm compatible zero knowledge rollup powering limitless potential of web3 right so all you have to do first is do what come here register this is an og this is a zq secret released pre early list right because you're early so click on continue i'll put the link in the comment section i'll put the link in the comment section and also in the description of this video right so click on continue this link i'll put in the comment section click on continue put in your email fill in your email right i'll just fill in one of my emails right fill in your emails right fill in your emails your email right once you fill in your email click on what next right once you click on next right connect your twitter right collect connect your twitter connect your discord connect your what uh uh your your wallet right connect your wallet right so that's what you're going to do right connect your discord connect your uh so once you connect your twitter they'll ask you to follow some people so follow it and you verify connect your discord i won't, I won't do that because i've not done, i've i've done this already right connect your discord join their discord and here we activate then connect your wallet here once you connect it they'll ask you to sign in to verify and you verify click this i'm robot and submit right the next thing you have to do is go to uh infura or sepolia faucet right sepolia faucet.com is I, I think it's the best right it's easier go to sepolia faucet.com uh create an account for those that have been following me here you know i've i've treated this before so you don't have to create an account you just have to log in if you're new all you have to do is what log in right so i've just been logging into my account because i already have an account okay I already have an account so i'll just log in right log into my account right then uh what you have to do is copy your wallet address right remember we'll be using metamax copy your metamax wallet address right copy your metamax wallet address if you're new i said create an account do you understand so copy your metamax wallet address i'll copy my paste it in here whatever it is paste it in here you know how it is right paste it in here right your wallet address click i'm not a robot and do what click on send me it and you receive some sepolia to your wallet all right so the next thing you have to do is come to i think this is the easiest yeah you can get 0.5 sepolia at least Right, every 24 hours can get 0.5 sepolia. So I've done this. So uh, uh, for this video, I won't be doing it again. So just I'll, I'll put the link for you. All the links will be in the comment section and description of this video. The next thing is come to zqt.com. Click on continue with testing. We are trying to create a wallet in our MetaMax for zqt. So click on continue. Right, click on continue. Uh, sorry connect with zqt right here click on metamax connect to i don't say continue sorry i mean connect to zqt testnet so click on it it will help create a wallet it will help create a wallet for uh for zqt on your wallet right so connect we've connected let's see so connect and approve okay okay sorry let me refresh let me refresh 
okay connect yeah use metamax right use metamax right the, you've connected the next thing is going to bridge right bridge dot zq.com right once you come to bridge dot zq.com click on connect wallet also i'll choose metamax it's best to use the uh, metamax it's best using metamax i'll refresh it's already connected my wallet but just connect your wallet you know how to do it let me disconnect so you will see so i'll connect click on connect choose metamax right and it's connected right now i'm swap i will swap you know i got we got some 0 0.5 zepolia so zepolia to execute i'm swapping from zepolia to execute so i'll just swap maybe 0 0.2 out of 0 0.5 you have you can just do 0 0.2 right bridge bridge from zepolia to execute so i'll click on bridge they say switch network so once you click on switch network that wallet you created for execute will be up okay zepolia okay we need to be in zepolia to what swap to execute 0 0.2 click on bridge right approve transaction in your wallet click on approve transaction in your wallet it will pop out and you click on what confirm right confirm confirm right we are waiting for it we are waiting for it uh so okay bridge in transit to zeki so it has gone the next thing you have to do is just click on this sign here so zeki to come this side and sepolia this side we have to bridge back from zeki to sepolia so you can bridge back maybe 0 0.1 0 0.09 or 0 0.085 we, we, we don't have to bridge everything we bridge don't bridge everything you bridge in don't bridge everything bring in out all right uh so that's why we are bridging just 0 0.085 remember we bridge 0 0.2 all right 0 0.085 we click on bridge switch network so now we are switching to execute right as a kid uh, switching towards execute switch network right 0 0.085 right click on bridge you know, approve transaction in your wallet and click on and click on confirm right click on confirm right and it will go so the next thing you have to do is come to nft dot nfts2me.com create stroke drop right we are trying to create an nft for execute so if you're on, you're on execute here click on testnet here and change it towards execute testnet right execute testnet now they want you to create a a an nft right create an nft create an nft so you're, all you have to do is come here click on here give it a name right i'll give you my own crypto token click on it is it's going to automatically generate a symbol for you type what a uh, crypto token is i'll say crypto token i'll do k right let's do k crypto token crypto token right crypto talk crypto talker well let's just use crypto token uh crypto uh this i'll just type in something this would bring crypto this will bring crypto to your doorstep to your doorstep and develop uh this will bring to crypto to your doorstep let's just leave it like that you can leave this at zero points I mean so you uh sequential minting right now minting fee you can put him 0 0.01 so people can easily mint with their sepolia 
right this is how to create an nft this is how to create an F nft right but right now we are creating on zq testnet so that we are helping them test their site right in case people want to create an nft on their site right so we are, that's why we're using zq testnet right so the next thing is what uh we'll just choose a minting fee you can choose 0 0.001 so people will not spend a lot when they want to try to mint yours or something any amount so collection size right now collection size put a to, before collection size come here get a, a picture right a picture you know nft is like a picture right so choose a picture that you want people to it, it, your nft should look like right so i've choose this all right i'll click on open right this is the picture right now it's showing collection size one now if you want people to keep if you want about 50 people 100 people you have to put in manually like click on add token right uh click on this again are you saying click on this chief uh, I'm, I'm clicking the same picture right this is two now collection size i've increased to two two people can now mint this nft if you want uh three are you saying it's increasing three right four i'll click four see it's four it's adding right the same picture five right so i'll i'll make it uh, 60 so for the first 60 people can mint this nft right so after that click on what deploy deploy execute test next right deploy execute test now I'll make it up to 60 right let me make it up to 60. so click on deploy execute test next and you you'll see something like this right so to increase the transaction uh before you okay before we say that let me show you let me so that bridging we did right click on confirm on confirm is confirming right this bridging it's best right see it as approved it's best you bridge back and forth at least 10 times sepolia to execute execute to sepolia at least 10 times right so you have more transactions on execute uh, on their platform all right so that's it uh what else so just allow this one to create so this one will just say it has approved here approved here here so creating drop collection right it's going to approve once they approve we are good right we are good please not subscribe to this channel can you subscribe to this channel turn on post notifications Same time i post a new video you'll be the first to be notified about my video right so it has approved here right so i'll put the link to this thing so you can mint it it's it, you're just meeting with your uh, uh execute test nets right this one we did for this video you're just meeting with your execute test nets. So i'll put the link crypto token dot dot nft dot me right so i've i did 61 61 so for the first 61 people you'll be able to mint this first 61 people you're able to mint it all you have to do is connect the wallet right connect your wallet and do what mint connect your wallet so I'll connect connect your wallet uh and you'll be able to mint right and you'll be able to mint uh let me connect this second wallet so you see what i'm saying right uh so you said insufficient this is the second wallet that's why but you you have some shares phone because you used that you uh interacted with uh execute uh, already I, i've already interacted in my first wallet but this second wallet i not i don't have execute this thing so you that has execute this thing you are able to mint so you just mint one click on mint right and that'll be all for the, this uh video right please like and subscribe turn on post notifications and i put in a new video you'll be the first to be notified about my video right subscribe to this channel please can you subscribe to the channel and i'll see you in the next video peace out